Hi dear children, good morning all of you. How are you all? You all are fine. I hope you all are fine and you all are safe. Don't forget to wash your hands with soap and water. You have to wash your hands every time. Welcome to today's class. Students, we are going to learn a new chapter, Keeping Healthy and Clean. What is the chapter name? Keeping Healthy and Clean. What is the meaning of this lesson? That we have to maintain hygiene. We have to maintain hygiene. What is hygiene? What is hygiene? Hygiene is a practice of keeping ourselves and things around us clean. What you mean by hygiene? What do you mean by hygiene? Hygiene is a practice of keeping ourselves and things around us clean. Practice of hygiene helps us to live a healthy life. Practice of hygiene helps us to live a healthy life. Now we will learn about personal hygiene. What, what do you mean by personal hygiene? What do you mean by personal hygiene? Personal hygiene means how we have to take care of ourselves. How we have to take care of ourselves. Personal. Personal means kud ka. Ya hamara. Okay. Personal hygiene means how we have to take care of ourselves. So we will learn about personal hygiene. Okay. See. Keeping healthy and clean. What is the chapter name? Keeping healthy and clean. Topic is simple rules to keep your body clean. Simple rules to keep your body clean. First point, brush your teeth every day. You have to brush your teeth every day. Use a soft toothbrush and toothpaste. You have to use soft toothbrush and toothpaste. Okay? Why should you brush your teeth? Now you tell me, why should you brush your teeth? When you eat food or chocolates, okay, when you eat food or chocolate, so they stick to your teeth. So they stick to your teeth. And if you do not brush, if you do not brush, then what will happen? If you do not brush, what will happen? Germs will feed on them. Germs will feed on them. What is the meaning of germs? Kidanu. Kidanu ayaga aake dago me. And that germs are called as what? Cavities. Tell with me. Cavities. You will get cavities. So, you have to brush your teeth. You have to brush your teeth. Next, bath every day with soap and water. You have to take bath every day with soap and water. Wash your hair at least once a week. You have to wash your hair at least once a week. Comb your hair every day. You have to comb Before eating also, after eating also, you have to wash your hands with the soap and water. Okay? Next, wash your hands with soap and water after using the toilet. After using the toilet, you have to wash your hands with the soap and water. Flush the toilet after use. After using the toilet, you have to flush the water. Next, cover your mouth with your handkerchief when you sneeze or cough. When you have 
sneeze or cough you have to cover your mouth with handkerchief see here okay wear clean clothes you have to wear clean clothes keep your finger nails short and clean you have to keep your finger nails okay nails short and clean what do you need to do you have to cut your nails every time you have to cut your nails every time time every time and keep it clean you have to keep your nails every time clean okay you have to keep your nails cut and also clean understood children next wear shoes or slippers when you are outdoors okay wear shoes or slippers when you are outdoor outdoors okay you have when you are going outside when you are going outside you have to wear shoes or slippers understood children okay now next we will learn about environment environment okay next we will learn about environment what do you mean by environment what do you mean by environment environment means things around us what what do you mean by environment environment means things around us what is environment what is environment hamare aas paas ke jo bhi cheeze hai usse hum kya kehte hain environment hamare aas paas ke jo bhi cheeze hai usse hum kehte hain environment okay now we will learn about home environment we will learn about home environment what is mean by home environment what is around us in our homes what is around us in our homes now we will learn how to keep our home environment clean how to keep our home environment clean that is how to keep our home how to keep our house clean okay how to keep our house clean if we do not keep our house clean if our house is dirty if our house is dirty rats rats insects germs rats insects germs germs means kitanu will get attract attracted and it will spread diseases okay if our home is dirty if our house is not clean okay rats insects germs attract it will attract our home and also spread diseases okay what do you mean by diseases what do you mean by diseases bimari okay what do you mean by diseases बीमारी हमारे घर साफ नहीं रखेंगे तो जर्म्स आएंगे ओके एंड वी विल फॉर सिक वी विल फॉर सिक सो वी शुड कीप आवर होम एनवायरमेंट क्लीन वी शुड कीप आवर होम एनवायरमेंट क्लीन सो लेट अस लर्न हाउ वी कैन कीप आवर होम एनवायरमेंट क्लीन let us learn how we can keep our home environment clean okay Sim simple to simple rules to keep your home environment clean do not bring food into bedrooms and flies and cockroaches cockroaches are at 
bed. They will come to our bedroom. Okay, and we will fall in sick. That's why do not bring food into bedroom. That's why do not bring food into bedroom. See here and flies and cockroaches. Next. Do not wear shoes that you wear outdoors inside the house. जो shoes आप लोग बाहर पहनते हैं, जो shoes आप लोग बाहर पहनते हैं, खेलने के लिए, खेलने के लिए, जो shoes आप लोग बाहर पहनते जाते हैं, वो shoes घर के अंदर नहीं पहनना चाहिए. Okay? Next. You have to throw waste only in dustbins. Okay, you have to or throw the waste only in dustbins. Okay, next, next point. Put back your books and toys after using the. Once again, put back your books and toys after using the. Okay. Books and toys 